So regular viewers of my channel are probably wondering why I'm standing up. In fact, I think this is the first time I've been shown standing up on camera. Well, the reason is I've just come home from work, as you can tell by the clothes, belly sticking out and all that. And um, I'm kind of tired of the way uh, my record situation is going. Um, as you can see, I keep my records in these cases down here. Now, these are really good traveling cases for your vinyl records, but the problem is, you don't really get that many records in them and I've got records, you know, all over the place, you know, to the side. Yeah, I don't have that many records, but the collection is starting to build up. So I've got one of these. This is the collection unit from Ikea. Uh, yes, that is probably the correct pronunciation, although most of us call it Ikea. Now this uh, unit, the collection unit, that's a K-A-L-L-A-X, is actually meant to be for vinyl records, or at least that's what people are using it for. And it's quite cheap. Uh, this one cost me 4,700 yen. And I didn't actually go to Ikea to buy it. I actually bought it from Amazon, Amazon Japan. So you don't need to go to the Ikea store either. So let's get it together and see just how well this is for storing vinyl. Okay, let's get this open. So now that the collax is built, how did it all go together? Well, surprisingly very good. And I have to say the build quality is very nice. As you can see here, the 12 inch singles fit in perfectly. Definitely ideal for storing your records. Seven inch singles on the other hand, well, maybe not so. Yes, the construction is very good and it is solid. It certainly won't be falling apart, even if it was full to the brim with 12 inch albums. Now the problem I have now is what am I going to do with these two DVD case holders? Maybe I can chop the bottoms off and stick them under the desk? <laughs> 